My name is David Norman Keith Thompson. Today is my wedding in the uh, Orthodox Jewish faith. Right now it is um, 7.25, which means I'm about five minutes late to leave the house, as always. And I'm going to be heading to Shul, to Synagogue Temple. I do that every morning, or most mornings. That's what we're going to go do right now. All right. Very important. Let's go pray. Hey, thank you. Today's the big day. One thing you'll notice today is that um, everything to do with Judaism is about like being like really thoughtful and really sensitive to everything. This is to fill in. It has God's name on it. And we're instructed in the Torah to put it on every day, except for Shabbat. Okay, here we go. Showtime. Time to go meet the boss. I forgot to invite anyone. The wedding is today at 5 p.m. at the Sephardic Temple. See you there. It's hard to remember everybody. So there's something called a shomer, which is somebody is supposed to accompany me for the entire week before my wedding to make sure I don't skip town. Or, you know, that's actually the main concern is just full on like making a run for it. Or, you know, just anything to do with um, something you shouldn't do before your wedding. My shomer is uh, asleep so at home, so if ever I had a chance to make a break for it, I could do it. I could do it right now. But I'm not going to because I don't want to. Because I'm very excited. Putting away the tefillin. See you later. See you guys later. Yep. Okay, on to the next thing. Okay, so I'm stopping in. I'm going to have a snack. I'm going to say hi to my friends. And then um, we're going to Vominos to the gym. Right, let's see who's home. I got all my friends from Canada staying with me. Actually, this is my friend from Arizona. <laughs> Yo! So this is my boy. This guy flew in from Denmark to come to the, oh, we're to on, the wedding. We're yeah. on live. Literally, this whole wedding was so last minute. It's a miracle anybody came. I didn't start inviting people to like a month before because I'm a space kid. This guy is a total legend. I He's love like, this guy. I'm gonna I'd come go. anywhere for this guy. Ah. Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? Where are you going to go? Go in there and see what Finney's doing. Oh, yeah, let's see what Finney's doing. Yeah. Is he sleeping still? There he is. I'm having a good morning. <laughs> You're still looking a little rough, to be honest. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I think you look great, man. <laughs> Anthony. You want to try on this tuxedo? You look like a bitch. I have no idea. It's in a box. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, we're gonna go to the gym at 11:30 if you want to come. Get a little pre, like pre pump in. Wow. Look at this. This what? is a good friend right here. Got the rush. Put the rush on it. That's a homie right there. Bro, check this out, dude. Bang, right. bang, bang. Nice strike. <laughs> nice, nice strike. Little, little, little swinger. Nice strike. <laughs> All right, this is exciting. Okay, so what else? Okay, I got to get on my phone and get. Oh, you know what we got to do? Let's call Ezzy. Oh, call Ezzy. Call yeah, Ezzy. For some reason, I can't. It should be ready, but like they said it was going to be. Peace. Hope you're having a nice sleep later. It's 9 30. We're going to go to the gym in two hours. So I got to book a hotel. Oh, there should be some plates here. We gotta smash some plates. I'm not exactly sure the purpose of the plates. Bingo. Okay, right. Getting okay, some calories in me. I'm really excited, so it's like eating is like gonna be hard, I think. <clears throat> Exciting day. Alright, we got the hotel is actually taken care of already. Probably Lexi. Typical Lexi. She takes care of everything. I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky. Oh, you know what I actually have to do is call my rabbi. Okay, looking forward to having you there. Alrighty. Bye, Rob. You too. Called Barbara, wedding planner. Bunch of sharks. Oh, Rochelle is who I talked to? Okay. Okay, okay, I'll talk to Rochelle about it then. No problem. All the best to you, Barbara. Appreciate you. Thank you. All right, so I just wanted to call. Um, so you got our you got our list of honors, right? 
you know what? I don't really need that. Your your rabbi needs that. Okay. Great. Okay. All right. Thank you, Rochelle. Bye. The list that I gave you. Yes. Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, bye. Now I'm going to go to the gym and uh, get pumped up. It is 11.40 and uh, we're going to work out. <laughs> Just got back from the gym, threw a little pump on the legs. It's 1.30. Got a nice workout. Charged up for the big day. Coming up and I'm going to be married in five hours I'll be a married man. Okay, I gotta put my bag here to remember to pack it because I gotta get a bag packed for the hotel tonight. Let's see if this guy can do one more favor. He's been, he's already done like two huge favors for me. This guy's such a mensch. I was wondering, you've already done two huge favors for me, but I was wondering if you had time to maybe help with one more. Thanks so much. Okay, thanks David, see you soon, bye. Hi, um, my uh, friend, my groomsman rented a tuxedo and he needs to come pick it up. I'm what he doesn't have a car. I'm wondering if I can send one of my other groomsmen to pick it up. Okay, great. Thank you so much. Okay, hold on. My mom, my mom can sew. My mom can sew. We can fix this. That's not good. That's not good. Rip tuxedo. Man. That's the next one. Uh, I think she can just like with thread. She can just whip it up. Yeah. Yeah, she'll be able to fix it. Mom, we have a sewing emergency. One of my groomsmen, their the tuxedo pants ripped on the seam. Well, they were already ripped when you put them on. Do you have any of your sewing stuff? You could stitch it up. I, guess we should yes. almost call I knew it. I knew it, Mom. I knew you'd be able to save the day. We'll, we'll fix it up when we get there, then. All right, I love you, Mom. Bye. I just want to say, like, about these guys, like, anyone that's here at this wedding is, like, a straight-up G. Because, like, to throw a wedding together last minute, like, two months' notice, some of these guys, I only gave them, like, a few weeks' notice, you know that, like, anyone that's here is, like, they're, they're a real one, basically. So props to these dudes. Yeah. Oh, you need it? It's kind of lucky, actually. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get showered up here. What am I doing right now? I still need to pick out a wedding song. I need to write the, the card to Lexi. And uh, I need to get showered and dressed in my tuxedo. And then after that, I'm going to the temple. Going to the temple and we're gonna get married. Going to the temple. <laughs> Dentist hour, bud. Dentist hour? 2.30. Ah, 2.30. Okay, uh, oh, I gotta bring some shoes. Where's this hole in this pants? Everything's gonna work out. Vinny, would you want to fix my collar in the back? Oh no, wait, he's coming here. Does anybody have any extra buttons for a tuxedo shirt? Are you serious? Um... What color? What color? Okay, Vinny's got some. Could you imagine if I showed up in these? Oh, Lexi would kill me, dude. Appreciate you so much. Three minutes, perfect. We're gonna get there right at three o'clock. to enjoy myself. Gotta enjoy the moment. I'm just like hyper focusing on dumb little stuff because I'm so like nervous and like stressed. I'm gonna call you back. I just pulled into the parking lot. I don't know if you can even hear me right now. Okay, let's call him back. Let's get in there. Yes. Yes. The yes. okay, We're putting that bag in the car. Yeah, cool. Could you grab the card out of there? I will. I'll do okay, that. Okay, thank you. 
Okay, um, Emily, do you have the list of who's walking with who? Okay, everybody. So, just uh, we lost the list, so we're gonna make up a new list. Start walking when the beat kicks in. Second is Drever and Lindsay. We're just rehearsing the the walk-in of the grooms. Yes. Okay. Oh, good idea. That was perfect, guys. Great job. And please dance while you walk. Can I, can I talk for a second? Yeah. And then here, try to see if you can do it. Because Actually, you yeah. I have no idea. Soul train, everybody. A little stress, but good. It's looking good. It's hard to corral, you know, 24 people. Guys, this is a professional doing that outside. Let's go. All right, we are running very shy on time, so let's keep it moving. Okay, so we just did the davening, and uh, uh, now we're gonna have a tish. All the guys are gonna get together and hang out, and uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. They're signing the kasuba. That's the marriage contract. About to walk in. You guys ready? Be Israel. husband and wife you'll attract the right person when you're as you become more and more comfortable and complete in who your true essence is and may we always love each other this much only more her answer what she said <laughs> we're gonna go get in the car and leave now and go enjoy our life together <laughs> 